a relic of the 1941 Blitz, a 3,000 pounder is discovered seven years after, buried in a Stepney back garden. 30 feet underground, sappers test the unexploded bomb for signs of life, and the great lift is on. The mid-morning Sabbath calm of the East End preparing its Sunday lunch is rudely disturbed as a thousand neighboring families are evacuated to a safe distance. Everyone gets marching orders, stretcher cases included. Roads up, traffic stilled, the Royal Engineers No. 2 Bomb Disposal Squad get down to the dangerous part of removing Britain's second biggest unexploded bomb. Using compressors, sappers drill round the fuse like burglars breaking into a safe packed with dynamite. Pathé cameraman Kenneth Gordon stayed behind to record the scene. After 90 minutes, Major Stanley Knight, the O.C., picks out the fuse and everyone breathes again. Its teeth drawn, the ghost that Hitler sent to haunt the peace of a Sunday lunch is hauled out of harm's way. A brave deed that made a tenpenny joint seem a banquet, even if lunch was a few minutes late.